the grace of God is sufficient for you. Never forget this. If you find yourself in a situation which is beyond your control, never forget that you still have the control of your heart. I mean, you can decide on how to react. You can decide on what to say. My people, a bad situation handled well is most likely to turn out good. In a good situation, handled in a bad way, is more likely to turn bad. But again, a bad situation, handled badly, turns out disastrous. Paul and Silas are the greatest example of this. They found themselves in a very bad situation. Jailed for preaching the gospel. But the way they handled that situation, they handled their situation with utmost care. And because of that, the very situation and are good. Your reaction to whatever you are going through determines the end. What you say to whatever situation you are facing can either energize the situation or bring down the situation. When Jesus found himself in the boat in a situation that called for fear panic, he decided to react in a positive way by means of faith. Paul and Silas reacted by means of faith. Daniel reacted by faith. Meshach, Shadrach, and Abednego by faith. Moses by faith. And this is your time. If you are a child of God, you must be a woman or a man of faith. And if you are a man of faith, your reaction should be a reaction of faith. Because the greatest tool that the Almighty has given you is your faith. React by faith. Talk by faith. Walk by faith. Look at your situation by faith. Whatever circumstance, whatever situation you are going through, faith is there to rescue you.